Andrew's one of our assistant captains. He's from uh, Colorado. He's been a great asset to our program the last two years. He's a he's a real leader. He's a real motivated player. He brings a lot to the table. We're just excited to have him back for a second year. He's a well-rounded human being. He likes to rock climb. He does some crazy things. He likes to, you know, he likes the, the Colorado atmosphere. He does his river rafting, like I said, rock climbing, all those kind of outdoor, outdoorsy kind of things. But uh, first and foremost, he's an outstanding character. And, and with him being at Air Force, yes, he is disciplined. He comes from, uh, you know, a great family. He went to Shattuck St. Mary's. He's got a lot of pride and respect uh, for himself and his, and his family and where he comes from. I I grew up on a ranch and so we had a pond that froze over every winter and my dad would go out there and plow it off and so me and my older brother would go out there and mess around and I fell in love with the sport and then I went to Shattuck St. Mary's which is a prep school in Minnesota and we were in a tournament up in Calgary and that's when I met Troy Mick, uh, the GM for the Silverbacks and he recruited me. I uh, had some offers to play in the States as well but I liked the style of the BCHL and the atmosphere here. Salmon Arm is very similar to my hometown of Steamboat Springs, kind of a small town, homey feeling, so I knew that I'd be comfortable coming up here. Uh, I'm obviously not a huge guy, so I didn't want to look for a very physical league. Um, don't get me wrong, I like to be physical, but I don't like getting killed every shift, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> um, but yeah, that played a big role in my decision. I mean, we had some positives and negatives from last season. Obviously, we didn't finish how we wanted to finish, um, but the returning players, we took a lot of positives from that and we learned our lesson for sure and I mean we're excited to get things going and change the outcome this year. I'm really excited about this season. We uh, have a lot of good players coming in. I think we're a lot more or a lot deeper this year um, and we obviously might not have a Landon Smith this team but hopefully we'll have more spread out scoring so a more even team. Well yeah Air Force is in Colorado so it's gonna be nice to play in my hometown or home state again um, for the last six years I've been across the country so my parents and family haven't really been able to see me play that much so that played a major role and also my grandparents were also in the Air Force so it's kind of nice to go back and serve my country and I'm really excited about it. Time now for overtime with number three Andrew Farney and Andrew number one do you have a Twitter account and what is your handle? I do and it's at Andrew Farney. Jet planes or tanks? Jet planes, obviously. Favorite pregame meal? Uh, pasta, chicken, and red sauce. What do you do for fun in Steamboat Springs? Uh, in the winter, skiing. In the summer, biking, kayaking, climbing. Everything outdoors. Favorite movie of all time? Lone Survivor. Favorite NHL team and why? Colorado Avalanche because hometown, home state. Who is the most obnoxious hockey fan in your family? Probably have to go with my brother. Pizza or burgers? Burgers. What do you do in your free time? Anything outdoors, adventure. What do you always take with you on the road? Uh, headphones, gotta have music on the bus. And the best piece of advice given to you is? Always keep going, never look back, stay positive.